Hey guys, it's Ken. How you doing? Heading into school for the last time this year with students, that is. Today's the last day of school for those guys. I'll be back tomorrow, though, to wrap things up. Back when this was the Orlando Naval Training Center, all of these homes were original to the area. And right here, you can see where the road changes a little bit. Right here at this corner, where we're passing through right now, was one of the checkpoints, one of the entrance gates to the Naval Training Center. It used to be a nuclear submarine out there on the water. Anyway, I took up a camera to show you guys this beautiful sunrise. I do love coming this way, heading into my school to catch a glimpse of a beautiful sunrise. I thought I would share it with all of you. Last day of school, May 29th. Here we are. And here we go. Hey guys, it's Ken again. This time at the end of the last day of school. I stayed a little later than I wanted to, but I got some uh, dusty, dirty, heavy lifting things done to get the classroom ready for the summer. They are using my room for summer school. And yes, I will miss my students. And yes, I will miss my fabulous first grade team. I, I, I teach with an amazing group of professionals and friends. I'll miss all of that, but there's one thing I won't miss. And that would be this dismal, horrible ride home. But today, I'm gonna treat myself to something nice to celebrate the end of the school year. And it's right over here. Okay, it's not right over there. It's way down there. I would normally be going left here on this road, but not today. Today we're going straight through and we're going there. And today I'm going to enjoy a couple tacos made with Beyond Meat. Now you can get a vegetarian version with the cheese or do what I'm gonna do and keep the cheese off and get avocado. All right, let's unwrap these tacos. I also got a small assortment of hot sauces. The original is called, well, Miles. Their medium is called Del Scorcho. And the one I'm looking forward to the most is the hot the Del Inferno. They do slice the avocado here fresh. I was watching somebody behind the counter slicing avocados as I was ordering. Yeah, check that out. That's so good. That's really good. It's got a classic taco flavoring, taco seasoning. The avocado is nice and rich. Yum. Let's try it with the uh, mild sauce here. Here we go, it looks a little messy, but should be delicious. That looks and tastes just like a finely seasoned ground beef. Only one more to go. That Del Inferno, it had some heat behind it, that's for sure. See, it says right there, treat yourself. That's just what I did. Those were completely satisfying, simple, classic fast food tacos on the go, very good, and all vegan, thanks to Beyond Meat and the folks here at Del Taco. So congrats to Del Taco for embracing the Beyond Meat movement and bringing something delicious to a whole new audience, if you will. So, let's head home. What do you guys think? Here is a true indication that summer has started. At the start of summer, Oviedo High School offers driver's ed courses. So you can see in the distance, there's all those caution cones and all the driver's ed cars are parked in the parking lot sit out here and watch high school students 
test for the driver's permits. Sometimes the most unexpected surprises can turn out to be some of the best surprises. I'll give you an example of something that happened to me today. For those who know me, know that I need readers. When I'm reading things like menus at a restaurant or books or small print on a label, and especially emails. So I'm walking around my classroom. I mentioned that I've stayed a little later than usual to get things wrapped up and closed out for the end of the school year. And I glance over at my email screen and I notice I have a new email from a parent of mine. Okay, today's the last day. So these are my, uh, my outgoing first graders, brand new second graders. And I notice in the subject line, all I see is the faint wording of my name, Mr. Foster, and some other words in the subject line. Then I see that it's carbon copied, CC'd, to my principal. And I glance down at the, the bulk of this email, and it was a pretty heavy email. It was a pretty good sized paragraph. I thought, oh man, someone has got something to say about me, to me, and copied my principal. So I grabbed my readers and I figured, you know what, do I want to look at this now? What if it's really bad? What if it's somebody who's really irate and not happy? Waited till now to tell me and to tell her. So I grab my readers and figure, you know what? Suck it up. Whatever it is, it is. It is what it is, right? So I sat down and read it, and it was wonderful. It was a praise email. I'm not saying this to you guys right now to kind of showboat or to say, hey, look at me. I'm not doing that at all to brag. I'm doing it because I was very pleased <laughs> that this dreadful pit in the pit of my stomach feeling turned out to be such a good thing and I guess the point of saying this is in my response to her email was your email shows me reminds me of just how powerful words can be the words that you say they can really lift somebody up and the words she had to say the praise she had about yours truly really made me feel good it, it, the, the words will always be in my imagination. I'll always remember her, her words. So I thanked her for her kind words. You know, I can get gift cards and, and, and food and gifts and all kinds of things from all of my parents. And, and uh, those are nice to get those. But the things that really matter the most are the words. So when my students write me handwritten letters, handwritten cards, and emails and notes like that from parents. So I thought I would share that with you guys. That was a fun little unexpected um, happy very happy way to end the school year. But we're not ending our vlogging, that's just starting. Lots of fun things planned. This summer, you and I hanging out together. Big, 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 big plans. So stay tuned for that. If you like my video, give it a thumbs up. That tells me you watched it and you liked it. Feel free to share my video. Subscribe if you want to. It's free to do, though, to do so. And tap that little notification bell. That way, when I do upload a new video, hopefully tomorrow, you'll get a notification and yeah we'll party this summer big plans stay tuned hey look somebody's making an appearance right over there is that ruby sue it is ruby sue hi ruby sue how was your day today did you enjoy your meal they, they just had dinner there you go Put your big, wet, cold nose right in their faces. That's all? Nothing else to say? Alright. Thanks for stopping by.